One, two, one, two, three, go! Hey, 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 fill it up, fill it up, hey! Hi, I'm Pete Hoffman. I'm here today to talk a little bit about the history of the Collinsville Extreme Club. The Extreme's roots can be traced back really to a couple of girls, uh, Jennifer Hoffman and Krista Swift. Uh, back in the late 90s, there were very few opportunities for girls to hone their skills during the summer. Uh, while the boys had the Junior Legion and American Legion programs, the same opportunities weren't available for girls. So uh, Krista's brother, Brett Swift, and myself decided to take it upon ourselves to start a club where the girls would have the same opportunities in the summer that the boys had. Uh, and having a lot of discussions with Brett, we realized that we had a lot of the same ideas and goals about the way the game should be played. Um, we did not put the onus on winning, we put the onus on developing. Development, fundamentals, and all those sorts of things. So. Uh, we started with a couple of teams, a 14 and a 16U. Um, as uh, Brett's sister and my daughter got older, we realized that development opportunities for the younger kids uh, still needed to be met. So we added a 12U team and a 10U team and, and uh, moved on to a college development team, the Extreme Elite. Uh, now we're branching out into baseball. Uh, the future looks bright for our club, but we've never lost the same goals, which are developing fundamentals, and teaching kids the right way to play the game. Hi, I'm Megan Martin, formerly known as Megan Buckheim Bucky. I played from 14 and under until 18 and under. I was asked what I thought Extreme Pride was, and it, to me, Extreme Pride is showing up to every practice and every game, just excited to be there, knowing that if I give my all, that my team's gonna give right back to me and just being a part of an organization that has that kind of a, a legacy is important to me. Hi, I'm Lauren Popoff and I'm a former player in the Extreme organization for over eight years and I'm a current coach from the organization. And to me, Extreme Pride is having faith and belief in working towards something bigger than yourself and working towards that with a group of people who have the same faith and pride and work ethic that you do. And that's something that I carry with me today in everything that I do and I hope that I can teach that pride and faith to others. And it's an awesome feeling to be able to look back in the extreme organization today and see the same pride in girls that are coming up through the organization now in realizing that someday they're going to be in the same spot I am and we'll have the same pride and be able to carry that tradition on. Hello and welcome to the Collinsville Extreme. I'm the 12 u head baseball coach Shane Lottie and I'd like to personally welcome you to the Collinsville Extreme website. I feel very blessed to have been a part of this organization for the past few years. You know, not only from the head of the organization, Brad Swift, to the surrounding cast of board members, coaches, players and parents, this has been a great opportunity for me to grow both as a coach and as a parent these last few years that I've been associated with this organization. You know, the organization itself really does stress not only on-field performance, but classroom performance as well. And athletes are rewarded for this performance. Um, to help back up the performance on the field, the organization boasts an indoor batting cage, actually indoor batting cages. But we are looking for not only the right talent, um, but also the right attitude and dedication. It takes hard work. Um, and dedication from not only the players but also the parents as well. We understand that there's a lot of commitment involved and not only uh, for players but also the parents to be able to transport um, your young athletes and the trade-off is in the end the athletes get better and they'll enjoy playing at some of the best facilities against some of the best teams and this is a recipe for you know lifelong memories and a lot of fun as well. My name is Krista Swip and I played for the Collinsville Extreme when it very first started. I now am a lawyer in Chicago and I learned a lot of things from playing with the Extreme that are helping me with my current profession. I think lots of team sports um, translate well in the workplace, but with the Collinsville Extreme in particular, you really learn to work hard. You learn those intangibles that you don't always learn with teams. You come to practice every day and you're expected to give 110% of what you have that day and if what you have that day isn't 
110% of what you normally have, then you're sure to be pushed hard um, and pushed beyond that. And that's something that has really helped me in my current profession to, to come every day to work and know that I have to give 110% of not only what I have that day, but what I have every day. I'm Susie Tate. My daughter is Jordan Hillard who played for the Extreme for two summers. She played on some amazing teams. She got some amazing um, direction from the coaching and she, her skills just really seemed to produce after that, I thought. Other than the skill part and playing the softball, the, the family interaction was just over the top. This is where it happened for her. And this is where it happened for us to um, meet people, to get an extended family. Everybody is right here. They'll stay there. Hi, I'm Jordan Hillard. I played with the Extreme until 2007 from Mount Vernon, Illinois. Um, and now I'm a police officer in Missouri. The Extreme family meant a lot to me while I was here. Uh, they always gave me uh, offers to stay at their places because I was from an hour and a half away and everyone wanted me to go to their high school and play ball and hang out with them. I made a lot of them. All my best friends were here and not at home. But what really stepped up to me was after I left in 2007. I got really sick and had to have a lot of surgery for um, some really bad stuff. And I got cards and visits and phone calls and people stepped up and held me up when I couldn't hold me up anymore. So Extreme Family means a lot to me and it, and it always will. I've made friendships that, that'll never go away. And they're the kind of people that it doesn't matter if you see them 10 years from now, you pick up right where you left off. So I love my Extreme Family and uh, Extreme Pride. Hi, my name is Jen Sohut, class of 2007. I am the head coach slash player of the 23 and team. I was asked about how what I felt about extreme intensity, and the first thing that came to my mind is when I tried out for extreme, made the team 18 and under, Brett came up to me and said, you will not settle for the level of play you're at now. He's like, I will make you better. And from that day on, every time I came to practice, shoot and be better. I was challenged by coaches, I was challenged by players, parents, I challenged players, I challenged coaches, and that environment, just everybody challenging each other was what made our team so successful. I loved every minute of it, and I truly believe that if it weren't for the extreme intensity, I would not have made it to where I did at the Division One level. And I still carry it with me every day of my life, no matter what I do, whether it be just running on my own, whether it be at work, whether it be school, it's everything. Be the best and expect nothing less than excellence. My name is Emily Morris and I currently play for the Extreme Legends and I also help coach the 18 and under Extreme Elite. To me, character is who you are and what defines you. And if someone were to ask me what defines me as a person, the Extreme organization is one of the first things I would say because it's so important to me. Extreme has taught me dedication and hard work, persistence, and how to give 100% in everything that I do, not only in softball but in life. And to be able to grow as a person while playing softball with this organization is priceless. My name is Alexa Becker. I just finished my freshman season at Murray State University. I currently play for the 23 and under Extreme Legends and I also help coach the 18 and under Extreme Elite. The Extreme organization has done so much for me. They have not only helped me become a better player but also a better person. They have helped me mature, not only physically, but mentally as well. Without the Extreme Organization, I would not be the student athlete I am today. Family, pride, intensity, character, and commitment. That's what we were built on, and that's what we're going to be for years to come. The Extreme is committed to all facets of building our players, our coaches, and our families. And we will do that with softball, we'll do that with baseball, who knows what the future will bring. But as long as we stay true to those absolutes, those very, those five very important 
characteristics of our organization, extreme pride will live on forever.